Welcome, everybody, to another episode of Aliens Fire Team Elite. And uh, we'll be tackling the second episode in the campaign of uh, Gift of Fire. Yeah, we're recording this Thursday, and it should be out tomorrow, or in this case, Friday, for everybody. Alright, let's see if we can uh, get some people. This usually takes the longest. Well, I guess not the longest, but it takes forever to load a mission. This one's not bad. But I definitely. I guess we can save that for the last mission. Um. Let's do this one, actually. Honestly, it's probably the easiest one to get a little bit extra XP out of. I mean, there's a couple other ones, like, um... Obviously, the, uh... Rewarding Discovery, I think that's what it's called. Yeah. But they're... Harder to get, though. So, usually save those for, um... The final mission. Uh, for the last campaign. Yeah, we'll definitely be covering that pathogen, uh, DLC. Uh, we'll probably start it... Yeah, we'll just upload it the next Friday of the last episode. I'll probably make a new... Th I'll probably put in a different thumbnail for it, but it'll be in the same playlist, though. I'm hoping for this game that they maybe do some more DLC. Uh, like campaigns and stuff, because I'd love to see that. Oh, come on. Hopefully we'll get some people, but I don't know if we will. It's about quarter past two in the afternoon during a Friday or Thursday, my bad. Um, a lot of people are at school and whatnot and jobs, so you can hope. Oh, oh, there we go. This guy's name is Blade. Oh, he's got the draw three challenge cards. That's not bad. It's actually pretty good though, because that can give you the uh, order and discovery. And there's a blue one that gives double XP. That's pretty good too. I mean, I don't really need challenge cards. They're nice to have, but at the moment, I kind of would like to have more XP. I feel like that, because I don't know. You can get this cool cam uh, uh, camos for your guns. They're related to your prestige level. I think that dude's silver. So sweet. <clears throat> we'll get a little bit of bonus XP. Hopefully, um, we won't get a lot of lag playing. Uh, this is just uh, well. There's not a lot of systems running at the moment, so the internet should be running smoother. Friday night, though, come if you guys are watching this live stream. Might do a uh, challenge of sorts or something. Um, maybe COD involved, or maybe Red Dead. Like, a, it'll be an adult stream. Uh, We'll plan to do that. Maybe a drinking stream. <laughs> Alrighty. So, I, uh, since last episode, I did some research, and apparently, the most recent update, the, uh, made it so the. Sorry, I was trying to clear my throat there. I just had to mute myself, but, um,. The recent update made it so that the, uh, the gun that I'm using 
uh, cannot fire without a good lock for whatever reason, which is weird because I don't really think it needed that. Um, although I hope with um, maybe a newer update and stuff, we'll add a uh, mod or an attachment onto it. Yeah, no, I don't know. I said mod, but an attachment for it that allows it to fire well aimed in to not need target lock because that's kind of silly. I'm hoping, but who knows? I wonder if they added it to help with uh, so you don't uh, mow down a teammate. I feel like that should just be something skill based, so you don't you know light up your teammate. Oh, you can. Some people are managing their positions and stuff. I mean, because you can still light up your teammate with this thing if you're just hip firing. <clears throat> you just don't get as good a um, hip lock or a uh, target lock when you're firing from the hip. I think we should be getting some. Critters that are infused with the uh, the black goo. That, or I think it might be next campaign, possibly. Actually, no, it has to be this one. Now that I'm thinking on it. That's kind of silly. I'd love to be able to just... Okay, there we go. I keep forgetting that I gotta hit fire if I don't want to lock, but... You know, I think it's not as good as the lock. When you're just firing from the hip, it's not as accurate. Even with a target lock, I think. Ah, dang, he got away still. Oh, dang, I got, fuck, I got the audio glitch. Where it's just, uh, non-stop. Okay, there it goes. Thank God. Oh, I didn't get him with that? Damn. <clears throat> I thought I got him there with that one. The little strike took some of my health, too. Here's something. Oh, yep, there we go. That's what I was hearing. Prowler. Oh, he said Prowler, so there's one hiding somewhere. Oh, leg spike. Holy crap. I don't know if it showed, but it uh, it froze on me there for a second or two. There's... Oh, he's stuck on the roof. Oh, well. <laughs> Sound gross. Let's clear out some bugs. That stuff's easy peasy. Might as well just save the turrets for uh, when the shit hits the fan on the next mission. I got 
got your back. Incoming targets. Oh god, here comes the audio bug. Yep. Shit. Oh, hello. Anyway, uh, do you watch uh, Bad Batch for any of those who are watching? Are you guys into Star Wars? Yeah, new episode was pretty cool. I'm not gonna say any spoilers about it. I just thought it was a neat episode. Oh crap, I thought my missiles were ready for a second there. Oh shit! Don't touch me, you heathen. No touchy! Woo. Huh, at this point, maybe I should just get a flamethrower. The last dude stuck on the river or something? Grabbing ammo. What the hell? Don't see him down there. He must be on top. Maybe? Even now I don't see him either. Where the hell is this dude at? Is he glitched? He's definitely glitched. Wow. I think this is the most buggiest experience I've had in Alien since release. It was pretty bad when it fully released. He's down here. Well, I got him. There we go. Yes, ma'am. Lock it down. Oh, that guy uses a uh, blast a little too late. Ooh, man, that bug got roasted. That dude must have the uh, one where you can fire multiple times, but it's not as strong. I think is the one he's using. I'm getting a deja vu moment, like I've recorded this one already. Oh, hello. Aha! Suckers! Yeah, I really don't like that target lock failure crap. That's so dumb. It's kind of silly, actually, more, more than anything. Let's 
gonna put them down like that. Have some bogeys in coming now. Get him! This is not a good spot to be in. Oh, I just realized I need some ammo. There we go. All stocked up. Uh, I don't think I should use my med kit yet. I, I think I can wait. It's kind of cool though. Aha! There we go. I was worried I wouldn't really hit nothing with that, but it seems I got something. That's a spinner. Take his ass out. I have to keep uh, mutant to clear my throat there. There we go. Oh, that guy's got a. That guy's a pretty good shot with that weapon. Kind of cool to see uh, some other critters come in this game, like new xenomorphs and stuff. Ambush. I know I don't think it'll ever ever happen since they're technically wiped out and like a special specialty thing. But um, the red colony of xenos was super cool. I thought. We already got like a kind of reddish xeno with the hey, prowlers, but um. But I'd really uh, like to see a red colony of Xenos. <clears throat> I thought I think it'd be pretty dope. I don't know how they'd go about doing it, but um, yeah. Or um, a pred alien would be kind of cool too. Dang bugs, man. <clears throat> Just wipe them out in one fell swoop. Maybe I'm trying to think. Maybe uh, boilers from Colonial uh, Marines for the 360. Kind of cool to see some of those. Although I don't know if anybody really would love to see them there. <laughs> Especially, uh, I mean, I've heard that that a lot of people don't really like the game. Uh, I enjoyed it. Although that probably is. Because I probably played it when I was a lot younger. 
It's probably like 13 or 14 when I played it for the first time. And I absolutely loved the the uh, game. That's that's probably why. We'll go ahead and set basic sentries first before we um, put up the good ones. Oh yeah, I totally forgot about first aids there for a second. Well, I'm glad they say it. Oh, wait, never mind. I don't. They're all full on uh, health. Sorry if I'm just like all over the place. A bit uh, sleep deprived. <laughs> uh, Rise has been pretty much taking up most of my time. Oh wow, I'm terrible. You're not going nowhere, drone. And I, I can't get the angle on that guy. Jesus, these guys are doing work. to boost attack, I think it's a, pretty sure that's what it does from memory serves me right. Also, uh, whenever we finish the series and the DLC, uh, what would you guys like to see after this? Uh, let me know down in the comments what you guys would like to see. I was thinking maybe we go to an older game, like Call of Duty 2, maybe. Or... Hmm. I don't know, something that I uh, can usually... I guess story-based is, is what I'm trying to think about what uh, would work with this channel. Ah, oh, I thought I could uh, roll out of the way. Shit, well, that didn't work. That's a soldier. Those guns are almost out of ammo. Oh, oh, drone! Oh, I was a little late on that one. <laughs> Again. All right, let's go and put more turrets. There's a lot more warriors for this mission. I don't know why I was thinking that. These turrets are doing work. I'll tell you what, man. There we go. I think that guy was stuck up there. Yep, that's it. Heck yeah. Oh wow, it's about that typical kind of 25, between 20 and 25 minutes kind of range. The other ones are, some of them are a little longer than others. Yep, there's the shim. Sh oh my god, shim. Ship. Uh, I think it's the same one from Prometheus, and I'm pretty sure it's the same ship from Aliens Covenant, I think, is where that ship's from. There we go.
All right, let's see what we got. Oh, nothing really new. Just a couple cards and some currency. Ooh, heck yeah, we did level up though. All right, well, thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, hit that like and subscribe button. It would really mean a lot. Also, if you'd like to know when I upload, hit that bell icon. That way you're notified every time I upload. Also, I'd love to hear your thoughts and uh, some comments and stuff down in the comment section, obviously. Like, um, what's your favorite uh, alien alien or aliens movie of the alien franchise? That, that includes all the alien movies, the prequels, and even the AVP crossovers. So as always, I hope you enjoyed this video. Goodbye.